Fine. It's 7.55. School already started. Stop laughing. <laughs> Katie putting her feet on me. Oh! Uh, what's in my backpack? Am I allowed to kiss you? Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, bye. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I was sleeping on the couch because I felt, okay, I woke up in the middle of the night, couldn't go back to sleep, went back and slept on the couch. Mike comes out and he wakes me up. I'm like, hey, I go, Mike, what? Ryan's supposed to be at school. Ryan, Ryan, it's 7.55. School already started. No, yes, it is. Nobody's at their alarms. I did. Did it go off? No. You're late for school. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this. Katie, did you set your alarm? Katie, it's 7.55. Ryan's late for school. School already started. <laughs> I, can't, I can't, I can't even. I can't even. Oh my gosh. Can you get in the shower really fast? I'm going to make breakfast. Did your alarm not go off? Oh, unbelievable. I, I'm, I'm unbelievable. Unbelievable. <laughs> Ryan did. Oh, jeez. Oh, I feel so bad for him. All right, let's go. Let's make him breakfast, okay? Jeez. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. He's already late. He's already tardy. Already tardy. First day of school. I can't believe it. Oh. Gosh, you guys, so listen, again, in the middle of the night, Edward woke me up. Edward's meowing and meowing me up, like three o'clock in the morning. And I could not get back, I'd like, get up, took care of him, I'm about to sleep, he meowed again, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I end up like putting him in a room and shutting a door. And then I couldn't fall back asleep. So I'm like, okay, let me get out of bed and go somewhere else. So I got out of bed and I went up out and I slept on the couch. I did not bring my phone with me. Stupid, 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 stupid. But I think it was still, I didn't set an alarm, which is, that's also stupid. That's probably one of the reasons I woke up. Anyway, oh my gosh, it's 7.55. School's trying at 7.30. <sighs> Stinks. Okay, there he is. Katie, you ready? Dude, there's no actual way. I know, I'm, I'm still shocked. I'm still shocked. What happened to your alarm? I have no idea. Okay, that's all right. And I should have set an alarm too, and I did not. You didn't set an alarm? Huh? You didn't set an alarm? No. I thought I'd wake up, and I did. Because I was up for three hours in the middle of the night because Edward kept waking me up. So I switched and slept on the couch. I closed my eyes at 5.38 thinking, oh, this is just for a second. I'll wake up at 6. Mike walked out at 7.55. That's exactly what happened. Okay. It's all right. It's all going to be good. This is, a, this is definitely a good memory. Or it's, I don't know, good right now. It's definitely a memory. Right, let's make some cereal and then we'll skid out. I already, already wrote your note. Okay? Okay. We're taking the um, necessary first day of school picture. Ceremonial. Ceremonial first day of school picture. And this is, uh, are you doing it? Wait, are, are you taking the picture? No, she's I already did. <laughs> oh, it's our day, wait. We had a lot of nice plans for this morning. We're gonna wake up at six, you to be there at 7.30, so our school starts at 7.30. We're gonna wake up at six, Ryan was gonna take a shower, I was gonna shuffle around, get my coffee, make him some eggs, he was gonna go in and roll around. Hey, I Katie, was gonna wake up the last second and hop in the car and drive him. That's right. We we're gonna come downstairs. He was gonna eat his breakfast. We we're gonna talk. talk a little. Right. He was gonna show you his first day of school outfit. He was gonna show you what's in his backpack for the first day of school. And then Katie was gonna take him in the Jeep and we we're supposed to wake up Brennan because Brennan was like, yeah, I'll go if I'm, if I'm awake. So Katie and Brennan were supposed to drive him in the Jeep. Then when he got there, he was gonna be there early and he was gonna meet his friends who said, hey, we don't want you walking into the first day of school by yourself, so let's all meet up at, in the parking lot. Did they text you? Yeah. And what'd they say? Whoops. It was Ryan with your schedule. <laughs> First friend I've texted. <laughs> I saw a lot more reactions like that little boy. I'm only laughing because I'm in shock. Like, I, like I'm laughing because it's funny. It is.
is, it is, it's, it's, I feel bad That's for so, Ryan. so, like, I wanted to, oh. I know, I know, I feel bad. We had this whole, it's like, you think about it, like, you had this big, like, stop laughing. It's not, stop. It's like, if you had, like, a big play, like, let's say you're an actor, you have this big play coming up, and then, you, they just say, you know what, we're gonna cut your, like, first roll, and you're just gonna start halfway through the play. <laughs> You have no idea what you're doing. So that's basically the situation I'm in right now. I think it's even worse than that. Bro, when I heard Bob's <laughs> voice this morning, I was like, oh. <laughs> When Dad came out, I was laying on the couch, I was sleeping on the couch. When Dad came out and it woke me up and the sun was up, I knew I was in trouble. I'm like, oh my God. Oh my gosh. He goes, what? What? I'm like, Mike, what time is it? He's like, why? I said, because Brian's supposed to be at school. He's like, he's not at school. I'm like, no, no, no. No. Wait, no. Um, so did, did mom, did you not set an alarm? No. I didn't even. And I, I don't know why. Hey, Katie, this is my story. <gasps> and you guys have already heard this, but listen. At three I was like, oh, mom will come wake me up. At three o'clock in the morning, I get woken up by Edward. Meow, meow, and I get jump out of bed because I don't want him waking up dad because that'll make up dad, make dad mad. So I get up and I take care of him. I go back to bed. Meow, meow. This happened, I'm not kidding you, for two hours. So finally, until two, so three, so till five. So I decided I was gonna put him in the um, in the room where he has his food and stuff. And I closed the door, I'm like, forget it. Then I go back to bed, I feel guilty. Like, oh my gosh, what if he's in there and he wants to come out? <laughs> so I go out and I sleep on the couch upstairs. And then I like, nah, this isn't gonna work. So I let him back out and I go downstairs and I sleep on the couch downstairs to make sure he won't go back into mine and dad's bedroom. So sleeping on the couch, it's 5.38. We're supposed to wake up at six. And I'm like, well, I'm just gonna shut my eyes for a minute. Didn't even think to turn my alarm on. Set a timer, nothing. Next thing I know, it's 7.55, sun's up. I am so sorry. That was probably the stupidest thing I could have done. <laughs> but I was exhausted because I was up for three hours. I was up, well, yeah. two and a half hours in the middle of the night, I'm up. And you didn't go to bed that much before, too, did you? Well, we went to bed at 11, what, 11? Yeah, it was like 11 30. <sighs> and everybody's going extremely slow this morning. Because I think there was an accident. Oh, really? I think it's elementary schools. I think it, it's uh, just everybody out. Like, the police are out with their lights on and everything saying, slow down, everybody, go very slow. So we're going 17 on a 40 mile an hour road right now. <laughs> I have no idea. Did you just wake up? Question mark, question mark. Who said that? I'm saying kind of. Uh, sugar. We tell them we got lost on the way to school. Yeah. Yeah. An hour <laughs> worth of loss. <laughs> Once I heard, because, okay, I was sleeping, and then I finally hear, and then I wake up, it's 7.55, Ryan's going to be late, or something like that. <sighs> and then I, and, and I was like, faintly, and I was like, no, no way. And then, and then you wake me up, the sun's up, I check my phone, 7.55. Bruh, I, I, I just started giggling. <laughs> it's terrible. It's absolutely terrible. It's terrible. What? The people at the front. Oh, and all my no. homies were like, we don't want you walking in alone the first day. We brought <laughs> you back. What? And I was like, thank you guys so much. They were like, got school. Like, all right, Ryan's first day. Let's go. Let's, you know, make it feel special. We're going to walk him in. It's going to be sick. And I, <laughs> now, not only are you walking in by yourself. But you're with your mom and late. And with your mom and late. And late. So fun. Okay. It's all going to be a funny story. Actually, it already is a funny story, but for Ryan, it's going to be funny. Right, because he doesn't know what's happening next. It'll, I'm looking forward to when we come home. <laughs> like I don't have to walk into my first time. <laughs> exactly. It's all funny if I engage with it to you. <laughs> my legs are sore. Ryan, this is the thing. Do it with confidence. No. Anything, you, right? No, that's actually true. If you just do it with, if, like, anything in life, if you're just confident, it actually boosts, like, right. everything. That's exactly right. The success rate, per se. You got it, baby. You got it. I mean, this. the Orioles won yesterday, so I'm not that <laughs> mad. Is that your like, excuse? I can't be in that bad of a mood, but, like, it's pretty bad. All right, stay tuned to find out what happens. We're going to be there in, we're only halfway there right now. <laughs> I just stayed in the car, you're like, go ahead, Ryan. <laughs> Yeah, if I just drop him off, so you figure it out. Ryan, are you nervy? Yeah, Dude. we're like getting close. I'm like, I don't know what to do. Were you more nervy for right now or for when you were getting on the bus to I go to? Um, Honestly, right now. <laughs> I, I I moved here within five days with the camp with you. I did not know. 
and I'm more nervous right now. <laughs> because all of those people ended up being my friends, and we're yeah. all ended up, and that's the people I was gonna walk into school with. Yes. Know this though, ah, know watch this. Watch that bowl, watch that bowl, watch that bowl. It's good, it's good. There's probably a, a huge percentage of people in here who are also new, and they think that what you're oh, doing look, is normal. all these people are late too. Yeah. It's great. Or, well, yeah, they wouldn't have taken an online class first day, would they? Maybe, I don't know. If they park in visitor, it means they're late too. Just like us. Wait, I don't. Here, it's okay. <laughs> oh, no, maybe they're just coming <laughs> so... up. It's all it's good. It's okay, why? It's okay. Oh, late. See? Late. Oh, don't pull it right next to him. That's so weird, Mom. Why would you do that? I'm pulling in the white. I mean, where else? I... This is the parking lot. It's embarrassing. You could have pulled a bro down. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> okay, are we ready? Here's your note. <laughs> All right, Kate, you stay in here. Oh, there's someone next to us, too. Let's get in line. Oh. We don't want to be, we don't be in line er, late and not being to wait no, for it. All right, bye, sweating. guys. Good sweating. luck, Ryan. Oh, I'm sweating. Oh! oh! Shut up. <laughs> and he has sweat stains. Shh, that's not nice. That's so mean. All right, Ryan, so you'll have to do outfit of the day and what's in your backpack when you get home, okay? This is not good. <laughs> yeah. We are not the only people. There's a group in front of us. They're late. I think there might be some people behind us. Like, where have I what am I going to do? I'm walking back to class like, oh, late on the first day. Oh. I don't know if I'll say that. Just, just you got lost. Crap. I don't know. I'm going to yeah. have to throw hands to the teacher. Mom. No, no, don't do that. Don't do it's that. not good. All right, we're about to walk into the office, so we're going to let you guys go. Good luck. I love you. Well, I'll kiss you later. Am I allowed to kiss you? Tell okay. Me. <laughs> okay, bye. All right, so this is what happened. So we got up, and there's an intercom. Like, you push the button. It's not a visual intercom. It's just a, like a voice like intercom. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I said, my son, um, I'm dropping my son out for school. And she said, okay, I'm gonna open the double doors behind you and you can go through. Okay, so I opened the double doors and she goes, go through the, ca so have him go through the cafeteria, pick up a schedule. That was the end of it. So he said, okay, he gave me a hug. I wish him good luck. And he went through the double doors. Oh, that was no. it. Now there's another little boy behind us who was also late, his mom was there. And when they were telling me on the intercom, I'm gonna open the double doors and send you through the cafeteria. The mom was behind me was like, hey, is that the same for my son? Because her son's in ninth grade coming here. Aww. Is that the same for my son? I said, hold on a second. I said, so there's a woman behind me with her son. Is it the same for them? And she said, yeah, yeah, just go to the cafeteria. So I said, okay. So he, the like, <laughs> little kid was like, oh, like he hadn't been in the school before. He didn't Aww. know they couldn't come to orientation. So I said, Ryan, you take him, show him where the cafeteria is and let him know what to do. And he's like, okay, okay. So Ryan like walked in, the two of them walked in together. So he, he already helped another little boy and he's the new kid. Yeah, the little boys. Here. It's so funny because it's like, oh, a little boy. Except for like a freshman in high school. Like, they're not like a little boy. Right. But, he, but like. Uh, emotions run high. Hormones are going. Like, it's a whole different ballgame. It's, it's, uh, everything's important. You know what I mean? Like, what I'm wearing, the way I walk, who's looking at me, all of that stuff. I totally get it. But I put 100% confidence. That's funny that you say that. Back. Because when I was a freshman, you were like, Katie, no one cares. Blah, 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 blah. Let's go to first blush. <laughs> Hi, Alice. How'd that go? Well, did you cry? he did not cry. Did you cry. No, he was very bold and very courageous. <laughs> and there was a little boy behind us who was going into ninth grade who was also late. So Ryan helped him. And they, so, but I don't know, like they just said, we'll open the doors, you go to the cafeteria and get your schedule. And that was the end of that. See ya. Oh. Yeah. They wouldn't let mom go in with him. They wouldn't let me go oh, in, really? which, which is fine. I'm in high school. I mean, still I'm, I'm in, I mean, he's in high school. Huh? Were there still kids bustling around trying to figure out? No. They no. Were no, exactly. <laughs> but there were there were three people. Like, there was someone in front of us in line, and then me in line, and then somebody behind us in line. Oh, good. Yeah, so it wasn't. Did so you get it late? I didn't even have to give the note. Oh. Yeah. Phew. You might get a pass for the first day. We will not do that again. <laughs> late on the first day of school. Love, Katie. Hi, uh, yeah, Alice. And Alice was just spying a lizard out front. Where did he go? He's right there on the chair. Where? Oh, I see him on the chair. Alice, Alice, do you see him on the chair? Do you see him? Oh. Oh. Oh, 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 there there we go. Oh. 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 Okay. No, she, she just wants to snuggle with Katie. She just wants to snuggle with Katie. She just wants to snuggle with your Katie. Hi, sweet girl. Oh, she's there she is. She is purring. She's so cute. She's such a good girl. She sleeps through the night, unlike her brother. <laughs> All right, I gotta go wake up, Brennan. He has an doctor's appointment.
It is about 2.40 in the afternoon and Ryan should be completing his school day very soon. He texted me. First of all, he texted me to let me know that um, he forgot to bring a lunch to school. So that was awesome. Then um, he texted me, or then I looked up his schedule online and come to find out he was signed up for, like he didn't do this, but and no offense to the school, but like he was assigned to um, four classes that he has already taken. So he's already taken biology, geometry, and US history and basketball, and he was signed up for those. So hopefully, they have so many new students in this school though, but hopefully they'll be able to get on that soon and he'll go to the next progressive classes, but we'll talk to him about that and see what he says. Anyway, also then he texted me, and said that he's getting a ride home. So he doesn't need me to go pick him up. His friend Maddie's gonna bring him home. So hopefully we'll get to see him soon. I think class, I think school ended like 10 minutes ago, but it probably takes forever to get out of the parking lot. Um, but I'm just so happy that he has friends already at school and I cannot wait to hear how it went. Hopefully he met some new kids. But the thing is, if he met any new kids in classes, they'll probably won't be in the same class because I think almost all of his classes are gonna change. Looking forward to hearing how he did. But he'll be home soon. Hi, sweet pea. Are you looking forward to seeing Ryan? Yeah? You've just been sitting on my lap while I've been working, haven't you? Katie, yeah. are we going to go to the Goodwill today or tomorrow? Yeah. Ooh. We're looking forward to going to the Goodwill. There's a really, there's a lot of Goodwills around here. It's a really good one that we really like. Oh, well, I think we told you about it. Brendan and Ryan already went there and got some stuff. So I think as a little treat, um, when Ryan gets home, we'll all head over to the Goodwill. <laughs> okay. So, uh, mom wanted me to do a little outfit of the day for the first day of school, and what's my backpack? Unfortunately, this morning, it would, you know, you, you can probably guess how it, that would, you know, been a problem. Anyway, so, uh, what's in my backpack? I don't really have much in my backpack. On the I first brought, day of school. We'll compare right. this with, like, later on. Like right, I probably about. will have more stuff. But I brought my computer, just because I mm -hmm. thought I might need it, because it's all used at you know in Maryland. Sure. Um, and then I brought <laughs> just Katie's old thing for it. like. Because it has paper it. in it, right? Yeah, it has paper, and I I got one paper today at school, and so I put it in there. Okay, perfect. Um, what was the paper? It's just this like thing I need signed. It wasn't even like it's not like homework or anything. Uh, and that's. I brought pants. Pants? Because mom was like, I made him bring these pants. shorts might be too short. These shorts are fine. I don't uh, know. And so uh, it's a new school. Pants. I don't know what they've got going on. I got my computer charger. Perfect. And a pencil way at the bottom. Yay! Oh, Did really you use it today at all? Really little pencil. Oh, no, no. I gave you a, like a, a... Oh, no, yeah. that's In the front. Bag. Yeah. I used it to sign one thing. Okay. So, that's what's in my bag. Um... <laughs> That's already there. Outfit of the day. Got the Air Maxes. I got these for Christmas. Um, these socks I got last school year, actually. And then uh, this is our shirt that we wore to camp, and all of the camp homies decided to wear it on the first day. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so everyone else was in this shirt. Oh, that's we awesome. It was like a cult walking around school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I bet. I bet. I love it. Was it. So, uh, and then just some short shorts. Nice. Polster. Those are terrible shorts. They're terrible. You no, let them go to school like that? They're comfortable. They're terrible. Okay. okay. All right. <laughs> well, okay. Wow. Excellent. I don't uh, know if you need to get that in depth in case you guys are wondering what's on my wrist though. Young Life bracelet. Bracelet of my old school. Bracelet I got at Florida State. I have no idea what, what it is. And then Katie just gave this to me. Oh, that was when nice. she was cleaning out her jewelry box one time. I love it. It's a very nice one. Okay, very good. Well, That's thank it. you for sharing. I appreciate it. Um, so, are you ready for day two? So ready. Yeah? It's, it's Excellent. My... You're going to go to bed early tonight? Set an alarm, maybe? I think so. Yeah, it might be a good idea. Yeah. Uh, apparently, your ringer has to be on for your alarm to work. I didn't know that. And I how didn't... long have we had, have, have had phones? They've had phones for a but, yeah. um, okay. Yeah, my ring is definitely gonna be on. So, excellent. Better. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and make dinner and then uh, we will wrap up this evening. Sound good? Mm -hmm. All right. It is the evening of the first day of school for Ryan. He is winding down. Is that <laughs> uh, where it is? Um, Ryan. Yeah. What made you happy today, my lad? 
walking into the first day of school, uh, was, it was, actually that's not what made me happy today. Uh, no, getting out of school was what made me happy. Is that right? Uh-huh. What was your favorite part about the day? Like the school day specifically? Lunch. Lunch, yeah. Yeah. Uh, but also driving to school was kind of funny. Yeah. Like after like all the craziness blew over, it was kind of funny. And it wasn't bad. Like when you went in, it wasn't like nobody yeah, well, oh, no. nobody flamed you. You didn't get in trouble. They just said go to your class. Where did you get your um your uh, schedule? Cafeteria. Oh, okay. Were there people there waiting with printers and stuff to print them out? Yeah. And were there other people getting their schedules at the same time? Yeah, we all just kind of sat there and they called our names and they just gave our schedule. How about the little guy? Who, um, I walked with them all the way. You kind of did? Oh, okay, did you talk to him? Mm-hmm. That's nice. I bet you made him feel better. Uh-huh. Good. Mm-hmm. What's his name? Oh. Did you see him again in school? No. If you see him again, you should say, hey, how you doing? See what's up? Yeah. He's yeah, probably new and scared. Okay. <laughs> Excellent. All right, congratulations. Day two tomorrow. Thank you. Nice Let's do you. it. Brendan, what made you happy today, baby doll? Not Katie putting her feet on me because every time she sits down, she needs to put her feet on someone or like just pressing against them. It's crap. Like, My feet get really cold. No, I don't <laughs> care. Put on socks, put them on a blanket or something. Don't care. Not on you. Guess what TV show we're watching? <laughs> Good luck, Charlie. What made you happy, babe? Can I go first? I opened a bank account today. I had an interview today and. I had an appointment today, so I'd say it was a successful day. Yeah, you were very productive today. Congratulations. And we did some, uh, did some work today. Partnership work action. Fantastic. And you have another big, big day tomorrow. So do you. Really? Yeah. Yeah, we have a lot of shopping to do. Yeah. We have some things to do oh, to prepare true. for college, going to college. Oh, facts. Right, yeah, right. I, like I, I go to that place. So. What made you happy today, Katie? Made me happy today. I was watching Good Luck Charlie with my family and hanging out with my brothers when we were doing our filming. That's awesome. That's so fun. That makes me happy. You guys have so much fun together. I'm glad you're together. And it makes me sad that it's only going to be a couple more days. And then the next time we're together, I don't know when it's going to be. So we're trying to make the most of it. Thanksgiving. Before then, I hope. I hope I see him in Atlanta. Probably not. Yeah, I think so. I think you will for the Chargers game. It'll be so much fun. Fantastic. All right, you guys, what made me happy today was Ryan having his first day of school. And I agree, laughing in the car on the way to school was very, very funny. So I'm glad that that went well. I'm looking forward to Ryan's second day of school. And tomorrow, I'm getting some stuff done for both Katie and Brennan. So thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed today's vlog. Comment down below what made you guys happy today. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. For the latest in Live Happy and It's the Donnelly's merchandise, visit shopitsthedonnelly's.com. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.